Hi, my name's Robin Phillips and uh, I'm a jazz singer, pianist, and I'm so excited um, to be bringing you a brand new album. But it's not just a brand new album. This is my first originals album uh, for over 20 years. Uh, the last time I wrote a bunch of songs, I was a teenager and that was a whole different time. We're actually gonna drop it one song at a time because there's a big story to tell. In 2019, I went to the USA and I rode a Harley down from Chicago down to New Orleans. I wanted to better understand the music that I play and understand where it comes from. Something happened and it triggered this whole album. I was lying in bed in New Orleans um, and I couldn't sleep because the streetcar was rattling around, the St. Charles streetcar was rattling around outside. I thought, hang on a minute, I'm in New Orleans and the St. Charles streetcar is rattling outside my hotel room. If that's not a lyric, uh, there'll never be one. I started writing, laying in bed, listening to the St. Charles streetcar, can't get no sleep. And that became the opening line to Ode to Nola, which is the first single. And everything changed for me on the coming back from that trip. I knew who I was. I knew how I connected to the history of jazz. And I grew up here, but I've always been tapping into the coach from there. And it's okay to be me, because I am me, it's all, I, it's all I've got. And rather than trying to be something else, just being me influenced by all these things. So for the rest of that trip, I kept notes, I wrote notes, I just dumped all probably 20 years worth of thoughts. What do I think about the politics of the world right now? What do I think about some of these cities I visited? There's a song on the album about Memphis and Sun Studio, Sam Phillips. There's a song on the album about Clarksdale. There's a song on the album about Muscle Shoals. Ode to Nola is about New Orleans. But there's also a song called I'm Coming Home, which I wrote. I didn't sleep on the overnight flight back from the USA. And I wrote down what I suddenly understood about England. Um, it's a bit funky, a bit jazzy, it's a bit bluesy. Let me tell you who's, who's on the album. Um, we've got a whole mixture of people. Some of it is part of the Pinstripe Suit Band, Claire Brock, Louis Thorne on bass. Um, and then some of it's my Rep 4 lineup, which is Neil Cowell on guitar, uh, Jihad Darwish on bass, and Alex Best on drums. But Rep 4 became Rep 4 Plus when I added Natalie Rosario on cello, backing vocals and cello. Uh, some of it's got a string quartet on it, some of it's got the wonderful Soul Sanctuary gospel choir from London. And I just let each song go where it needed to go. So some of it was recorded here in Rep Music Studio, some of it was recorded down at Master Chord down in London. But also I've got Billy Kilson, the incredible uh, funk drummer from New York on uh, two tracks. And we've got Damien Nueva, the upright bass player, the Cuban upright bass player uh, from Paris. There's a lot to say on it. Come on the journey, connect with me online. I look forward to hearing your thoughts when you hear these songs. Thanks so much.